Hati wana warata galo, wana batala galo. Welcome to my YouTube channel. And today, I'm gonna tell you about the time that I went overseas and what I did overseas. So, let's get into it. So, if you all know me, uh, my name is Luzuko Nyawala. Yeah, Universal Travels. I went with Universal Travels overseas just to show you the receipts that I'm not lying. These are my flight tickets and everything. You know? And this is my passport. This is my passport. Uh, let me check for the stamps. Yeah. These are the stamps. Okay, so let's get into it. So it's uh, the beginning of 2017. So it's the beginning of 17, 2017 and I think in 2016, 2015, that's when, 2016 or 15, that's when I started playing rugby, you know. Actually, I'm a, I was an athlete, so a 100 meter athlete, a long distance athlete, 200 meter, 1.5, you know, short distance and long distance. Also, triple jump, high jump, you know, all these things. I used. So one day I was just practicing running around the field, you know. I'm running. So the rugby coach calls me. Hey man, call me. Yeah. So I'm like surprised. I go to him and say, Hello, say how are you? He's like, who the meal? So I see you run very fast. Uh, come join the rugby team, you know. I'm like, eh, hey, rugby team. Imagine when I'm on our land and jack, you see me that I'm I'm saying until I'm like, ah, so now I have to play rugby just because I'm fast, young tall. Uh, it's not good, by the way. Just because I'm fast, young tall. So now I'm like, okay, you know what? Uh, let me just because I was staying at hostel. So at hostel, like all of the boys, or what? I was dealing with, I was staying with colored Owens, I was staying with white Owens and, and black guys, you know. So Every time I used to get bored now at the rest because I would just go and jog and they would go play rugby and then they would come late and then they did they wouldn't have to study because we had a study session while they went to play rugby. So I decided okay let me go check out this rugby thing. Since I'm fast I might as well try and try. So then I, I go I so let's go, 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 go. The first, first training ever. Guess what happens? These guys, man. These guys, they say we must defend the big guys. We must tackle the big guys. The big guy must come running and he must bump you and you must tackle him. I'm like, ah, so gay. I took off my talk, so I'm like, ah, me, I don't want to. I walked away. Long story short, I ended up coming back and ended up, the coach told me he'll teach me everything and what what. So I, I started practicing putting hard work, hard work, hard work. And then there was a time that we went to Pitori and told Khruet Flay Academy. We went to Pitori to play against Bo, Limpopo, Blue Bulls, like all of these big teams. And our team was like a small team, but we, we played those big teams like nothing at all. Played those big teams. So they told us during it was like I'm a trial and trial. So during the trials, they tell us uh, at the end of the matches, we're gonna be choosing certain players that are gonna be going overseas. Obvious me, I'm like a bag and I'm not going anywhere. I'm just gonna play rugby to have fun and trial. But I guess they were just looking out. Then the scouts saw me and they were like, ah. The night that the coach called me, he's like, he called actually a few players and just wanted to see our reaction, asked us a few questions, we answered a few questions, then we went out. So, the next day, they are calling out names. When they call out your name, they're like, you're going, and hey, now they are calling out. I can tell that they are calling most of, of my team players. And I'm like, ah. So these people are very going to Ireland. If you don't know, Ireland is, but my England, or UK side. Thing. 
so bengi kuma kelani ka united kingdoms so bang figure ang ya bona they call that my name they like luzuko nyaula and i'm like that's me i'm going overseas so yeah oh the video is already 5 minutes for the rest of the story join in for part 2